Hello, this is Chad. Today we're going to look at a 16 volt VA transformer and a 16 volt 30 VA transformer. And we're going to see what the voltage differences are under load. Let's get started. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to hook up my test leads on this. We're going to do the 10 VA transformer first. And as you can see, um, this one is actually pushing out 20, 21 volts. It's supposed to be a 16 volt transformer, but it's pushing out 21 volts. I'm also gonna put an amp meter on this and we're going to see how much amperage it draws. Sorry, this isn't a great view, but uh, it'll work. The 16 volt 10 VA transformer is essentially rated at uh, 0.63 amps. We're going to test it right now. So pay attention to what the amps are and also what the voltage drops down to when I hit the doorbell button. So here goes. So first of all, we can see that the voltage dropped down to 13 volts. And we can also see the amperage draw is 1.12 amps. So that really tells us right there that uh, this transformer isn't enough power to power a video doorbell and power the chime at the same time. So if you've been having problems, uh, it's because this doesn't have enough capacity to power the chime and the doorbell. As we saw that the voltage dropped down to 13 volts and the required voltage for uh, ring and nest are 16 volts. The reason the voltage dropped is because of the amperage draw. Uh, this transformer is essentially rated at 0.63 amps and this was drawing one amp, well, a little more than one amp, and that's why our voltage dropped. So now let's go ahead and test this on the 16 volt 30 VA transformer, which is essentially three times the capacity of the 10 VA. Well, now we've switched over to the 16 volt 30 VA transformer and we're gonna run these tests again. Uh, you can see that the 16 volt transformer is actually doing 17.6 volts and we've got zero amperage and now I'm gonna hit the button and pay attention to what both of these go to. So you can see that the, the volts are still 16.4 volts and our amperage is actually 1.5 volts and it's holding steady. So this would tell us that the 16 volt 30 VA transformer is adequate to run the Ring Video Doorbell Pro or the Nest Hello or if you've got a, another kind of uh, video doorbell. I'm going to do one more test. We are going to uh, install the Ring Video Doorbell and we're going to hook up power kit to it, which I'm actually not going to use the Ring Video Doorbell one. I'm going to use the Nest Hello. Uh, I've done a lot of testing on this and I, I can't get it to work. I may have gotten a dud, but uh, I show no change once I hook this up. I actually have a little worse voltage when I hook that up and use it. So I'm going to use the Nest Hello power kit. Uh, I've had good luck with this. And so our next test is going to be with this hooked up. I would use a Nest Hello, but I've got it working on another project right now.
Anyways, so we're gonna re use the Ring Video Doorbell Pro. So now I have the Ring Video Doorbell Pro hooked up. I've got the amp meter on, I've got the power kit installed, and we're gonna be testing the voltage on the transformer. So uh, with the Ring Video Doorbell Pro, when I hit the button, it's gonna be delayed. So this says 0.23, because that's how much the ring is using as far as amperage goes. Okay, let's uh, try this out. You can see the, amp the amperage increased to 0.79 and the voltage decreased to 16.5. You keep the chime in place, you do need to upgrade your transformer to the 16 volt 30 VA. Do install your power kit, especially if you have the Nest Hello. This works really well. Anything important in this video, I will stick in the description. If you want to find out what transformer I'm using, go ahead and look at the description. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.